Greetings everybody, Edward Foshin here. Today I'm going to show you how to easily and safely purchase jewelry from an e-commerce store. One of the top reasons people worry about purchasing online is having their personal information stolen or as you've heard these days it's called identity theft. One way to combat that sort of thing is to take a good look at the URL in the address bar when you're visiting any site. You want to make sure it has HTTPS before the www dot and then the name of that site, not just the HTTP. If it has the HTTPS, it is without a doubt a secure site. This means that the site has been registered with an SSL certificate. And if you check out this link below the video here, you can read what others are saying to help make it safer to shop online. The link is Ease Your Fears of Online Shopping. Now, just to move on here, I like jewelry. I don't like wearing it so much, but I do like giving it as gifts, and I like to see it on my wife and others. And so I'm going to pick a jewelry site to buy a small piece from. I like old world style jewelry kind that they wear on the HBO hit series Game of Thrones. So I found this site here called the only thrones jewelry.com and so I clicked on it and as you can see it has the HTTPS up here in, in the address bar and it has a great layout and it seems to be pretty easy to navigate. That's a good sign. The first thing I want to do is check out the site for something to buy. I'm going to quickly scroll through this first category of men's and women's necklaces for something interesting. And I notice that they have quite a selection of different items and styles as well as many different prices, price ranges. That's a good sign for security as well. If you notice that the loading speed for this site is pretty quick, that also shows that the site is professionally built by a good webmaster. So sometimes you get onto a site that takes forever to load or is hesitant to load the images and that to me just smells like something's wrong. It's not always the case but it bugs me just the same so I usually click away. Okay so I'm going to look through a different category here and see what else they have. Alright this looks good. So let me go ahead and uh, select something. Let me show you what to expect when you click on an item and then proceed to the shopping cart for checkout. I'm going to just go ahead and click on this cheap little item here so I don't spend a bunch of money just to make this video, okay? So when I click here it takes me to the order page. One thing that I notice right off the bat is that it has PayPal for a payment method and that's a great sign and it's just another sign of security that stands out for me. And then, after I fill in my information on the order page, it takes me to the checkout page. So as you can see, I fill out this information and then I have to click the, the terms checkbox in order to proceed. So just make sure you tick that. And then I go on here as a guest check out to use my credit card and it hangs me up on my state putting in my state information and my phone number so just make sure you do that too and then you hit pay now and it takes you to the confirmation page so there you go bingo and then I just return to the site so that's as easy as it gets right there purchasing securely at an online store you don't need to be afraid because as long as you follow these guidelines for the secure site and secure payment method like PayPal you're as good as gold Okay, so this is Edward Foshan signing off. I hope I alleviated some of your fears about buying from an e-commerce store, and I hope you enjoyed watching this video. Talk to you soon.